I'm Dr. Rarig. Again, this is part B of our presentation. Uh, Dr. Zykowitz is helping me out here as a uh, as a uh, sucker. I mean, a suspect. Um, I mean, a subject. So we're actually going to be doing a little muscle testing to show you a little bit more about that. If you remember, we were talking about my little ping pong ball. There's a light and a battery in there, and if I supply some energy to these little terminals here, the battery is charged up enough to give uh, light to the bulb. And I'm going to show this in an interesting way. I'm going to have Dr. Zeke uh, touch the silver part of the ball with his index finger. He's going to touch that, and he's going to touch my other finger and watch the ball here. I hope you can see it. Boom. So we have a circuit through here. And when I show this to people, they go, yeah, it makes sense. You know, if you touch a socket and you're getting um, electrical current going through and somebody tries to help you, you get shocked too. Now we can use that information to locate problems within a body because we're electric. That's what made the little ball work. So we do that through what we call a muscle test. And what I do is, it's not arm wrestling, it's just a light pressure, not more than about maybe oh, 10 pounds if at, at the most. And actually I'm using my fingertips. Now when we test over the thyroid or the heart or the stomach in these areas, if they're functioning normally, we get a nice strong muscle uh, as I'm testing it. However, if we touch over a part of the body, let's say the pancreas, which is right down here, if I'm te testing here and I'm testing Dr. Zeke's arm and he goes weak, the light's out, like the ping pong ball. But to me, it says, hey, he's got a little problem here with the pancreas. Well, the pancreas controls blood sugar. It also helps you digest your food. So that would be a, a really good little piece of the body that, to take good care of. So we'd, we would want to focus to help that work better for Dr. Zeke. So whatever we find, that's, that's what we work with to help to improve. So I'm just going to kind of show you a little bit more about this, and we're going to muscle test some things. Now, Dr. Zeke's in pretty good shape. He's been on our uh, nutritional program for some time. He's been getting adjusted um, by myself to keep his energy flowing, his spine aligned. So we're not going to find a, lo a, lo uh, a lot, but we're going to show you how this would work. If I test the upper part of the bridge of the nose right here, he actually will go weak. And actually, that should happen. Because right here in a body, that's a neutral point. Neutral meaning positive and neg negative. The front part of the body is mostly positive. That back part of the body is mostly negative. There is a, a book called The Body Electric. You can get it on Amazon. It tells you all about what I'm describing. So if I touch the back part of my hand, which I mentioned is negative, he's nice and strong. But if I touch with a positive, he goes weak. When I do that test, it tells me he's got some good energy because he's reacting exactly the way we want to. Now, as I'm testing, I'm going to be looking for those organs and glands where I get a weakness. That's what I'm interested in because wherever there's a weakness, there's a weakness in energy flow. There's a weakness in energy, period. And that indicates a weakness or a malfunction or a problem with whatever we're testing. So we're testing over the heart, we're testing over the thyroid, testing over the bowel. We just want to find if they're working well, the body's going to be strong, Dr. Zeke would be strong. If we find a, a, a problem in the thyroid, he would go weak. So that's what we'll be doing when we're checking you. We're looking for those parts of your body that are not working as well as they should. It'll show up in our muscle test. Thank you.